when you create link styles within Dreamweaver, the one thing you're probably going to want to do is test them out. You want to see what they look like. And unfortunately, within Dreamweaver, unless I go to something like Live View, which is right up here, I can't hover over my links and see things like the visited colors or the hovers or things like that. But I want to show you a quick way that you can see that stuff. So I know this happens or you can do this within at least Dreamweaver CS5 and CS5.5. I'm not sure about earlier because my CS4 doesn't work anymore. So if you have a page open and you've created some styles for some content, I've got some hover styles and different things. What you can do is you can do this a couple ways. I can go into the view menu. I'll scroll down and I'll see toolbars and open up style rendering. That'll open up the rendering toolbar. Now, if you want to, you can also come somewhere up here in the gray area, right click or control click on Mac and choose style rendering. Now, if you notice towards the end over here, you'll see LVHA. This is kind of cool, but you're going to see style links for uh, styles for the link pseudo class, visited pseudo class. If I click that, hover, and active. So I can go in through and kind of see what each one is going to look like on these links. That's actually kind of a simple, simple way just to see what's going to happen to your links. Now you can also, you'll see it happens to your entire page. Visited, hover, and you'll see hover links right up here, as well as this content, I believe. So there we go. Pretty cool, pretty easy. Now you do want to make sure that you have the style showing, and this bar also allows you to toggle the display of CSS styles. So I will use this sometimes if I want to go in and just edit like a list for a nav bar. So I'll just click to turn off the CSS styles, go in and just do my editing, add my links, whatever, turn it back on, and you're styled again. So, and on the far left over here, I'll kind of ignore these for right now. These are media types. These are a little bit older, and they're not used nearly as much anymore. We tend to use a different, different method using CSS uh, for doing that sort of thing. But anyway, there you go. There's your style rendering. A lot of great things you can do with this toolbar.